why we were not invited to be Superman. <laughs> Can't follow the rules. Nope, nope. I think we've got like low level villain energy, like <laughs> slightly chaotic, but not super motivated villains. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jessa. And I'm Alex. And this is Jessa and Alex Watch. Superman the me. I think I realized I have never seen one piece of Superman media. Really? So you've never seen any of the like current crop of DC? No, I haven't seen any of the new Supermans, and I obviously haven't seen this movie. Um, yeah. I feel like I'm intimately familiar with Superman because I love Supergirl, the show. Okay. Okay. So that's the only version of Superman I'm familiar with is like the guy who shows up for like one episode, maybe a season in Supergirl. From what I've seen of Supergirl, she and her cousin are very much alike. I don't know. I love Superman. I just have such a soft spot for those True North characters, like fundamentally good characters. I, I will, I, I'm always there for them. Shall I do some predictions based on what I know? Yeah, let's hear it. So here's what I know. Lena Luthor is like... In Supergirl, always talking about how her brother is the main, like, villain of Superman. Mm -hmm. And so Lex Luthor is going to be the villain. So Lex Luthor, you think, is our main villain. What else? Yes. Um, There's a guy who has curly hair on the cover of this film (laughs) <laughs> mm-hmm. um i have no idea who that is um I, I he's gonna be faced with um kryptonite at some point i'm assuming sure oh and lois lane she's gonna show up she's gonna mm-hmm. doesn't she take pictures isn't or is she a journalist i don't know what she does she's gonna do what she does i think they're gonna meet i don't think i don't think it'll be an established relationship that's my little okay. guess uh is there anything i should say about the movie uh it was in production at the same time as the original star wars so it was like a, a good time to be into like sci-fi fantasy and uh the original tagline was you'll believe a man could fly because Superman had appeared before on screen in a TV show, but at the time, Superman could leap tall buildings in a single bound, but he didn't really fly because it was a TV show and they had like zero dollars. But so this was like a massive technological breakthrough to have Superman fly on screen. I'm actually interested to see if you catch on to the ways that this movie is the template for superhero movies. Like, I'll be interested Mm. if you catch, like, truly, like, legitimately entire scenes that turn up in, or at least in one particular modern superhero movie, because, like, this is the template. All right, shall we start? Let's watch. Let's do it. Ready, set, play. Imagine, though, being John Williams, and within the space of two years, you've written two massively iconic scores. It's just like, calm down, you know? Like, (laughs) give someone else a chance. Exactly. Like, Johnny, like, chill. This is very scary, this little wand he has. Is he going to brand them? What's going on? You will bow down before me! Both you, and then one day, your ass! Uh oh. That seemed pointed. Seems rough. Neither I nor my wife leave Krypton. But what about the wee babe? Like, no offense to your science, though, but like, shouldn't you have been aware of the climate change issue before, like, the day of the end? Look at that little fat baby. Um, I just want to those- chew on its arms. <laughs> Give me those chunky cheeks. Like, why did he have to go nude? (laughs) Why why couldn't the baby have clothes to go to Earth? Whoever gets that in their backyard is going to be like... Truly what? That's not from here, sis. But also, like, if you know the whole planet is exploding anyway, like, I don't know... Break your promise? Get on. Uh, yeah, I would have left with the baby. <laughs> what are what they going to do? do? He's 
like an honorable person or whatever. Uh oh, I broke my promise to the dead government that just blew up with the rest of my planet. I mean, I would get it if it was like they only have like this one ship, right? So right. not everybody can get off. So then it's more of a moral thing. Okay, so this is why I think he had to be naked because it's going to be time. He's going to grow up. And he's going to like expand in his little star nucleus. It is forbidden for you to interfere with human history. Wow. It came with brainwashing. Fun. <laughs> Here I am. Honey, will you hand me that right? Mama, look what I can do. <laughs> he would be pretty helpful around the farm. <laughs> I know. And I feel like I'm watching like an alternate version of um, <laughs> Anne of Green Gables. I don't like that they mentioned that the dad had an illness. Makes me feel not good about the future of this film. I can't do it. Are you kidding me? It is very Anna and Gables. It's Matthew saying, my girl that I'm proud of. Yeah. As he dies in Anne's arms. Oy. I love this whole section of the film, which is made to look like you've just, like, literally walked into a Norman Rockwell painting. Sometimes I feel like Superman is a really subtle Jesus metaphor. An earthly mother and a heavenly father raising a supernatural <laughs> son who's sent to save the world. It's subtle, but if you look, it's definitely there. Rut row. I hope we didn't awaken anything evil. <laughs> hope it's like a good little information ship that our parents left us. If it were me, I would have just dropped it like right in front of me so I wouldn't have to walk so far. Not Lois. Lois! I love Lois Lane. She is iconic. Yep. And I would like to be her. Yep. Hmm. You just described the is exact it contents of laser course. vision? Maybe you lead us to the big man himself. Lex Luthor? Ha! You, got it on. <laughs> you did it! I've got to say, this whole operation, sir, seems very unsafe. Sure does. Oh my goodness! Why is the most brilliantly diabolical leader of our time surrounding himself? Hmm? Lady. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you. Well, hey, Lois, maybe we can get... <sighs> Honestly, I think Clark is adorable. I would date Clark for sure. Tall, great hair, he's sweet. Good at his job, apparently. Lois! Superman! I appreciate Lois's calm and, and low-key reaction to <laughs> the danger. <laughs> Don't unbuckle! Lois! What are you doing, girl? I just don't know if this is wise, Lois. Nobody asked you to get out of the vehicle. That's because you're moving so much! Sit still. Try to keep breathing. Lois! Uh, stop pushing! Okay, everything's fine. This is clearly a setup for Superman to fly in. She's gonna want to write an article about him. Everything's fine. <laughs> this is a joke because Superman used to change in phone booths. <laughs> That's a lot of falling she's doing still. Like, yeah. Hey, who's got you? <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't believe it. I just, I just can't. Not. My favorite <laughs> random character in the movie. I can't believe it. I just cannot believe it. 
is so cute. Sir, this is like embarrassing for you. <laughs> this is not like the most attractive way to crawl up a building. I'm just saying. That's also how I count my money. <laughs> The theme says his name, Superman. So you'll hear that that little. So whenever you see him, like there, it does that. The music goes Superman. Wow, Clark, you are bold, sir. Oh, she got dolled up. Oh, oh, this whole thing, no. Lois. <laughs> Lois, let's be real, hun. It would make me uncomfortable if my romantic interest um, scanned my internal organs <laughs> for lung cancer. <laughs> I'm just gonna say. Do you have a girlfriend? Uh, no, I don't. But uh, if I did, Miss Lane, you'd be the first to know about it. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. It's so adorable. It's like. <laughs> and how big are you? How tall are you? Uh <laughs> the rest of your bodily functions are normal? Sorry, I beg your pardon? Well, putting it delicately. Mm -hmm. Do you... eat? Uh, yes. Uh, yes, I do. When I'm hungry. You do. Of course you do. <laughs> Excuse me. I sort of have a problem seeing through lead. Oh, that's interesting. Don't publish that. Why would you publish that? Pink. <laughs> Why do you like pink? I like pink very much, Lois. Lois? Hmm? You never lie. Lois, I really like pink. <laughs> <laughs> Peter Pan flew with children, Lois. He said, I'm not a child. He said, you're not a child. <laughs> well, I suggest a uh, vigorous chest massage. If that doesn't work, uh, 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 mouth to mouth. Yes, sir. You're oh, disgusting. You're I love a villain yes, plan that includes a lot of costume changes. Good for you. Barefoot and in a, a skimpy evening gown as she scales well, the bridge. Sex. My mother lives in Hackensack. Oh, Lex. Wow, foreshadowing. Try faster. Oh my goodness. I mean, Jesus. That's a lot that you're doing there, Superman. <laughs> Are you gonna, uh... <gasps> what?! What did he use, super glue? How'd he get the whole earth to stay up? <laughs> Please just roll over my back. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. I'm fine. It's great. Jimmy. Is this the best place to be standing? Jim. <laughs> Jimmy, let's use that upper body strength. Come on, buddy. Let's try to pull ourselves up. Oh my gosh, Jim. Maybe it's your time, man. I just... <laughs> Get out. Ah. Oh. This is horrifying. Yeah, no, like legit. No. 
What? That is you are here. Oh, I forgot for he could be the whole time. Those things I can. This movie really had me going for a second. I was like, I feel like I was not prepared for this. I also would like to point out that my friend Molly, she was like, oh, it's kind of like campy and funny. And so um, I wasn't ready to cry. <laughs> the problem with men is steel. There's never one around when you want one. <laughs> I'll tell you something, Miss Ling. I think he really cares about you. Clark, of course he does. Oh, not Clark. I love that Lois is like, oh, Clark, yeah, he's wrapped around my little finger. <laughs> um, yeah. This was so good. Yay! I adored this. Yes! I was, like, fully... I didn't know what to expect, but I was not expecting to like it this much. Yeah. Lois Lane is a total babe. Absolutely. I mean, she's fantastic yes that, that movie is just a really good movie I love how much time we spend um really establishing his foundation as a character like all the time we spend in um our green gables um <laughs> Smallville uh, yes Smallville oh 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 so, yeah I was I was thinking about that you know bec because we've been spending so much time with uh with Marvel movies this month and just the difference well and and right before uh wonder woman 84 um the difference in the way modern superhero movies are paced mm -hmm. versus this where like you said we spend so much time like the movie breathes a lot like i was watching that really beautiful shot of clark and martha standing literally amongst the amber waves of grain as they're preparing for him to like go out into the world like it's a film actually yeah you know I just loved all of the all of the rich characters too Miss Tessmacher like 100% didn't have to be in this movie but she right. was such a like beautiful part of it mm -hmm. you know it just like elevates it you yeah. didn't she wasn't necessary to make I mean she is necessary to like save Superman and make him go but you could have had someone else do that it just right I just loved I loved it I was watching you know when Superman flies into space after Lois has died and I've always thought that the voices he heard were just you know I don't know just like a a bunch of thoughts but I guess I kind of realized for the first time it's about him choosing whose son he is is he Jorel's son who will make like a choice to I don't know follow the rules even if it means death and destruction or is he Jonathan Kent's son who believes that he was sent for a purpose and yeah. that's him choosing that's who he is he is Jonathan Kent's son that's really lovely and the fact that you can watch the actors actually make each other blush in that yeah. scene. They have, like, a very intense, like, sexy banter that, yeah. like, just lets the sex linger, which is yes. much more intimate and, like, hot. It's wonderful. No, I really, I genuinely love that movie. Well, this has <laughs> been a fantastic time. Thank you so much for watching that with me, Jessa. You're welcome. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Uh, please like this video, subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click that little bell notification so you know the next time we upload. Bye. Bye.